So strong acids and strong bases are completely ionized in water and produces H plus and OH minus ions respectively along with the counter ions. The net reaction in the acid base neutralization is the formation of water from H plus and OH minus ions. The color of certain salts or their solution is due to the ions present. For example, copper sulfate is blue due to the copper 2 plus ions, and nickel salts are green due to Na2 plus ions. Metallic chromates are yellow due to CrO4 2 minus ions. Oswald's dilution law, common ion effect, and solubility product, and other such concepts are based on Arrhenius theory. Chemical reactions between electrolytes are almost ionic reactions. This is because these are essentially the reaction between oppositely charged ions. Here is a typical example. Hg plus and Cl minus gives silver chloride. So electrolytic solution conducts current due to the presence of ions which migrate in the presence of electrical field. So here you are able to see ethanol no conductivity. For potassium chloride high conductivity. Acetic acid solution low conductivity. Colligative properties depend on the number of particles present in the solution. Electrolytic solution has abnormal colligative properties. For example, 0.1 molal solution of sodium chloride has elevation of boiling point about twice that of the 0.1 molal solution of non-electrolyte. The abnormal colligative properties of electrolytic solution can be explained with the theory of electrolytic dissociation.